extreme heat and weather events here and around the globe, climate change is also having a measurable impact on a much slower moving development, the loss of glaciers and the melting of the ice. The melting of Earth's frozen landscapes has been accelerated by rapid climate change and global warming. Glaciers worldwide, along with the thick ice in the Arctic and Antarctic, are thawing at an alarming rate. This has significant implications for the stability of our planet and its ecosystems. However, amidst the melting ice, captivating historical secrets have been unveiled. Scientists, archaeologists, and even ordinary individuals have made extraordinary discoveries trapped within the ice. Given the vast expanse of ice on Earth, such findings should come as no surprise. Take, for instance, the Antarctic Ice Sheet, which spans approximately 14 million square kilometers and contains a staggering 26.5 million cubic kilometers of ice. Within this frozen realm, evidence of ancient human settlements and resilient microorganisms in the permafrost has been unearthed. Furthermore, it is truly astonishing to learn that the Antarctic ice sheet holds an astounding 61% of the Earth's fresh water. The melting of prehistoric ice has exposed a wide array of remarkable phenomena, including peculiar creatures, tragic historical events, enigmatic microorganisms from otherworldly origins, remnants of wars, and perplexing mysteries. Even the most brilliant minds of our time have grappled with deciphering these enigmas. From invaluable artifacts to ancient humans suspended in time, the frigid corners of our planet have yielded an astonishing range of unfathomable discoveries in recent decades. Join us as we embark on a journey of extraordinary findings, some of which are bound to send shivers down your spine. Number 20. The Mystery of the Swiss Couple In 1942, a Swiss shoemaker named Marcelin Dumoulin, aged 40, and his wife Francine, a 37-year-old teacher, embarked on a journey across a glacier from the mountain village of Chandeline. Their purpose was to milk their cows, which were grazing in a neighboring area. Sadly, the couple, who were parents to seven young children, disappeared without a trace. Fast forward to 2017, a ski resort worker made a surprising discovery near a ski lift in Le Diableray, situated approximately 8,600 feet above the village. It was the bodies of Marcelin and Francine Dumoulin, remarkably well-preserved alongside their World War II-era clothing. Additional clues, such as a book and a watch, further confirmed their identities. A spokesperson from the police in the canton of Valais later revealed that DNA testing had confirmed the bodies to be those of the Dumoulin couple. The discovery brought a sense of closure to their two surviving daughters, and finally put an end to the decades-long uncertainty that had haunted the local community. The evidence strongly indicated that the couple had tragically perished in an accident, likely falling into a crevasse on the glacier during bad weather conditions. Number 19. Ancient Skis Contrary to popular belief, skiing is not a modern activity, but has its roots in prehistoric times, making it one of the oldest known recreational pursuits. In 2014, an extraordinary discovery was made by the Glacier Archaeology Group called Secrets of the Ice. They uncovered a solitary ski at the Digervarden Ice Patch, situated within the Rheinheimen National Park in southern Norway. Remarkably, despite its ancient age, the ski had been impeccably preserved within its icy burial, with even its original binding, where the skier's foot was placed, remaining intact. For the following seven years, the team monitored the ice patch, eagerly anticipating the melting process that would potentially unveil the missing counterpart to the first ski. Their perseverance paid off. In September 2021, precisely seven years after the initial discovery, they spotted the second ski a mere 16 feet away from where the first one was found. Both skis predate the Viking Age and share similar characteristics, featuring a broad design with a raised foothold and preserved binding. The newly discovered ski is slightly longer and wider than the first, likely due to its deeper burial and better preservation. Researchers speculate that these skis may have belonged to hunters, travelers, or perhaps even both. Number 18. Fiona, the Pregnant Ichthyosaur In a remarkable discovery, the fossilized remains of a 13-feft-long pregnant ichthyosaur were found in Chile, 
marking the first complete ichthyosaur ever found in the country. The creature, named Fiona, was uncovered by researchers deep within Patagonia's melting glacier. Fiona, who lived approximately 139 million years ago, was found with several embryos still in her belly, indicating her pregnancy at the time of her demise. Ichthyosaurs were a highly successful group of marine reptiles that went extinct around 90 million years ago. They were known for their fish-like shape, resembling present-day dolphins. Contrary to popular misconception, they existed even before the emergence of the first dinosaurs. The expedition to uncover Fiona's remains took place in March and April 2022 at the challenging Tyndall Glacier. The glacier's remote location required a strenuous 10-hour hike, making the collection of the specimen especially difficult. Lasting 31 days, the expedition was described by the researchers as a difficult undertaking. Fiona is a significant find, representing the only pregnant female ever recorded and extracted on Earth from the era between 129 and 139 million years ago. In addition to Fiona, the team discovered 23 other new ichthyosaur specimens during the expedition, solidifying the Tyndall Glacier's status as the most abundant ichthyosaur graveyard in the world. Number 17. Sasha the Woolly Rhino While the woolly mammoth may dominate our imaginations when it comes to Ice Age animals, the woolly rhinoceros prefers to maintain a more laid-back presence, despite being a recurring figure in ancient cave art from the Upper Paleolithic period. While finding woolly rhino remains is not uncommon, stumbling upon complete carcasses tends to create a significant stir. This was the case in 2014, when a woolly rhino calf was discovered. It was found preserved remarkably well in permafrost in the far reaches of Siberia. Although the scientists were uncertain about its gender, the calf was bestowed with the name Sasha in honor of Alexander Sasha Bandarov, the individual who found the remains. Examination of Sasha's teeth revealed that the rhino was approximately seven months old at the time of its demise. Astonishingly, Sasha's size at seven months surpassed that of modern African rhinos, measuring nearly five feet in length and standing at about two and a half feet tall. Normally, African rhinos don't reach such size until they are around 18 months old. Initially believed to date back 10,000 years, an autopsy conducted by scientists later revealed that Sasha's age is 34,000 years, the leading Russian researchers involved in the study suggest that the woolly rhino calf likely met its fate due to drowning. Number 16. Very Old Seeds When it comes to reviving frozen organisms trapped in ice, it's usually a difficult task. However, our next discovery defies this norm, making it truly remarkable. In 2012, a team working in Siberia unearthed seeds from the last ice age, belonging to a flowering plant known as Silene stenophylla. These seeds were found buried 120 feet underground in the depths of the Siberian permafrost. The team stumbled upon this incredible find while studying the ancient burrows of squirrels. Thanks to the squirrels' adept burrowing techniques, the fruits and seeds had been sealed away from the elements. Five years later, scientists achieved a breakthrough by extracting tissue from the immature fruit and successfully growing silene stenophylla plants. These plants not only bloomed with flowers, but also proved to be fertile, as documented in a study published by the researchers. Interestingly, these ancient plants displayed a striking resemblance to their modern counterparts, still thriving in Siberia today. To this day, the question of how these seeds managed to survive for such an extensive period remains unanswered. In 2020, scientists in Austria embarked on unraveling this mystery by studying the DNA of these ancient plants. Number 15. Liuba In addition to the baby woolly rhino we discussed earlier, let's introduce you to another fascinating prehistoric baby animal, a baby mammoth named Liuba. Liuba, estimated to have roamed what is now Russia approximately 41,800 years ago, was discovered purely by chance in 2007. Yuri Kudi, a Siberian reindeer herder, stumbled upon her as the frost thawed on a muddy bank of the Yuri Bay River. When Kudi returned with a team of scientists to recover her, they were disheartened to find that she had vanished. Someone else had reached her first. Determined, the team tracked her down to a remote Siberian village. Astonishingly, 
Liuba was propped up on the door of a shop. The shopkeeper had reportedly acquired her by trading two snowmobiles and a year's supply of food from Cootie's cousin. However, while she was displayed, a dog chewed off her tail and ear. If not for this unfortunate incident, she would have been perfectly intact. Although Liuba is not the sole representative of her kind, she is among the best-preserved mammoth mummies ever discovered, regardless of being a calf. Her condition is truly remarkable, with her skin and internal organs remaining intact. Scientists even found traces of her mother's milk in her belly. It is believed that Liuba met her demise by suffocating after inhaling mud while struggling in the deep mud of a riverbed where her herd was crossing. Despite her short life of approximately 30 to 35 days, this little creature has provided invaluable insights into our understanding of her species. Number 14. Bronze Age Food Box In 2012, archaeologists made a remarkable discovery in a high alpine pass in Switzerland. They unearthed fragments of a 4,000-year-old bow, arrows, and a wooden food container that belonged to a Bronze Age mountaineer. These artifacts, along with other items, were found near the top of the Lotschberg Pass, a towering elevation of almost 8,800 feet in the Bernese Alps. The area where the artifacts were discovered became a site of great interest in 2011, after the guardian of a cabin stumbled upon several items emerging from beneath the snow. Recognizing the significance of this find, the Guardian promptly alerted the archaeologists, setting in motion a series of exciting discoveries. Now, regarding the bow, arrows, wooden food container, and accompanying items that were uncovered, they are believed to have been used by hunters or animal herders during the Bronze Age seeking refuge in the area. Remarkably, tests conducted on the wooden food box revealed traces of ground flour comprising a blend of grains such as wheat, rye, barley, and smelt. Some researchers speculate that this box was used to transport dry flour, later mixed with water or milk for consumption. Although the Lochberg Pass has yielded relics from the Roman era and the Middle Ages in the past, these remains are the oldest ever found in this region, providing invaluable insights into the ancient history of the area. Number 13. Relics from the White War during the First World War, an often overlooked Cold War unfolded, known as the Guerra Bianca, or White War. Italian and Austro-Hungarian troops engaged in intense clashes at altitudes reaching up to 12,000 feet, enduring bone-chilling temperatures as low as minus 30 degrees Celsius. Soldiers braved blizzard conditions while carrying supplies and munitions, even hauling heavy artillery using ropes and pulleys. Battles raged across the frontier, spanning from Trentino to the Adriatic for three grueling years. Remarkably, more soldiers are believed to have lost their lives due to avalanches, falls from mountains, or hypothermia than from direct combat. A century later in 2014, the warming world began to unveil its icy secrets. Relics of the past emerged from their frozen tombs as the ice melted away. The discoveries at the site include a multitude of artifacts, ranging from coins, lanterns, canned foods, bottles and clothes, to letters, straw beds, and animal bones. Over the past decade, dozens of soldiers' corpses, some still adorned in their uniforms, have emerged from the receding ice, bearing witness to the harrowing events of that bygone era. Number 12. Viking Era Mitten the discovery of ancient clothing artifacts is a rarity due to the rapid disintegration of fabric over time. Therefore, when archaeologists unearthed a hand-woven, left-handed Viking mitten from the melting ice of the Norwegian mountains, it sparked immense excitement within the scientific community. This remarkable find took place in an area known as Lendbreen, a high pass nestled in the Norwegian mountains. Lendbreen has served as a crossing point for travelers since the Roman era, and persisted until the late medieval period. Today, the effects of global warming have led to increased ice melting in these mountains, revealing new artifacts on the surface. Now, let's delve into the left-handed mitten that hails from the Viking era, specifically dating back to the 9th century. It is believed that the mitten was likely lost by its owner while crossing the mountain ridge. What makes this mitten truly special is its unparalleled uniqueness. No similar Viking mittens have ever been found elsewhere. 
Constructed from multiple pieces of hand-woven textile, the mitten features a gray, felt-like material for lining, which is still visible through the partially disintegrated fabric on the outer surface of the mitt. Number 11. The Underground Volcano When envisioning volcanic eruptions, one typically imagines the spectacle of hot lava and gases being explosively released into the air. However, a remarkable discovery by a team of scientists unveiled a smoldering volcano buried beneath a thick layer of ice in Antarctica. This groundbreaking finding marks the first identification of an active volcano beneath the icy expanse of the continent. While numerous volcanoes, such as Mount Erebus, project from the Antarctic ice, the existence of active subglacial volcanoes had remained unknown until the time of the discovery. Scientists anticipate that when this volcano eventually erupts, it will generate millions of gallons of water beneath the ice. With over half a mile of ice covering the volcano, an eruption of extraordinary power would be required to breach the surface. Nevertheless, the heat emitted by the volcano could accelerate melting at the glacier's base, causing the resulting meltwater to act as a lubricant, facilitating the faster outflow of the overlying ice into the sea. Consequently, there is a possibility of a slight rise in global sea levels due to this phenomenon. Number 10. Otzi, the Iceman In September 1991, an extraordinary discovery was made by a German tourist named Helmut Simon in the Similon Glacier of the Otztal Alps, near the border of Italy and Austria. Within the icy terrain, Simon stumbled upon the mummified body of a man, now famously known as Otzi, or the Iceman. When Otzi was discovered, he was wearing only a single shoe. However, many of his personal belongings were later recovered in the vicinity of the discovery site. As investigation progressed, it was discovered that he dates back to around 3,300 BCE, which means he is older than the Egyptian pyramids. He was estimated to be between 25 and 35 years old when he died. Initially, it was believed that Otzi succumbed to the harsh conditions of the Alps, freezing to death due to exposure or exhaustion. However, in 2001, an X-ray examination unveiled a surprising twist in his story. An arrowhead was discovered lodged in Otzi's left shoulder, indicating that he had been shot and bled to death. Further analysis of Otzi's remains provided additional insights. Although initially thought to be disease-free, researchers later found evidence of whipworm infestation and signs of arthritis in his body. However, these conditions were not contributing factors to his death. Otzi's remaining scalp hairs also revealed early forms of haircutting, offering a glimpse into grooming practices from ancient times. Additionally, his weathered skin displayed short blue lines, which are interpreted as either the earliest known tattoos or scars from ancient therapeutic procedures. Otzi is currently under the meticulous care of researchers at the South Tyrol Museum of Archaeology in Bolzano, Italy. To safeguard his well-preserved body, a custom cold chamber has been created, maintaining a constant temperature of minus 21.2 degrees Fahrenheit. This controlled environment ensures the optimal preservation of Otzi's extraordinary remains. Number 9. Ancient Forest When we think of frozen discoveries, we usually envision artifacts and treasures. However, the recent finding of ancient forests that existed millions of years ago reminds us of the mysteries our planet still holds. A group of researchers made an intriguing discovery, providing evidence that around 90 million years ago, Antarctica was home to a vibrant and swampy rainforest, thriving with diverse plant and animal life. They found remarkably preserved roots in a sediment core collected near Pine Island Glacier. The sediment layer stood out with its distinct color, clearly different from the layers above. Through CT scans, the researchers were amazed to find traces of pollen, spores, and remnants of flowering plants, including intact cell structures. Their analysis also revealed indications of heavy rainfall, an average air temperature of about 54 degrees Fahrenheit, and a summer temperature of 66 degrees Fahrenheit during that period. It was based on these findings, that researchers were able to propose that the coastal areas of West Antarctica once featured a dense and swampy rainforest adorned with conifers and tree ferns. An artist's rendition offers a glimpse of what this ancient forest may have looked like around 90 million years ago. However, a significant question remains unanswered. 
What caused Antarctica to undergo a significant cooling, leading to the formation of vast ice sheets? Researchers continue their quest for a satisfactory explanation, leaving this enigma yet to be fully resolved. Number 8. The Treasure Imagine traversing a frozen terrain and suddenly stumbling upon a treasure chest. This was an incredible scenario that became a reality for a French climber back in 2013. While scaling a glacier off Mont Blanc, the climber discovered a hidden gem, quite literally, when he encountered a trove of emeralds, rubies, and sapphires that had remained buried inside a metal box for decades. The jewels were estimated to be worth up to 246,000 euros. But how did this remarkable treasure come to be? The answer lies in the tragic history of two Air India planes that crashed into Mont Blanc. The first crash occurred in 1950, resulting in the loss of 48 lives. Sixteen years later, in 1966, a second flight operated by India's national carrier also met a devastating fate upon striking the mountain, carrying 117 individuals on board. Officials believe that the precious stones likely originated from the ill-fated 1966 flight, which was en route from Mumbai to New York. Now, as for the climber who found the treasure, he promptly handed over the box of precious stones to local authorities. In recognition of his integrity, the climber was later rewarded with half of the trove, consisting of hundreds of valuable gemstones. The other half was retained by the local authority as attempts to locate the family of the original owner in India proved unsuccessful. Number 7. The Ancient Tunic This woven woolen tunic you are looking at dates back to approximately 300 AD during the Late Iron Age. It holds the distinction of being the oldest complete piece of clothing ever discovered in Norway. Found in a crumpled state near the upper edge of the Lenbreen Ice Patch in 2011, this tunic bears the marks of extensive use. The loose-fitting outer garment with its greenish-brown hue is designed for individuals up to about 5 feet 9 inches in height. Patches on its surface indicate multiple repairs, suggesting that the person who left it behind may not have been its original owner. The archaeologists at Secrets of the Ice believe that this tunic was once worn by a reindeer hunter, likely combined with a waterproof outer layer to enhance its functionality. Remarkably, only a handful of similar tunics have withstood the test of time in Europe. Curiously, one puzzle remains. Why would someone discard a warm tunic by a glacier? One plausible explanation is that the owner, perhaps caught in a snowstorm, experienced confusion due to hypothermia. In such cases, individuals may erroneously perceive themselves as feeling hot and consequently remove their clothing. This ancient tunic offers us a captivating glimpse into the lives and challenges faced by those who inhabited these icy landscapes centuries ago. Number 6. The Buried Mountains Located within the heart of eastern Antarctica lies the Gamburtsev Mountains, a subglacial range shrouded in mystery. Stretching approximately 1,200 kilometers in length, these mountains reach an impressive height of around 2,700 meters. However, they remain hidden beneath over 1,970 feet of the Antarctic ice cap. Interestingly, the Gambertsev mountain range spans a comparable size to the renowned European Alps. The discovery of these subglacial mountains dates back to 1958, when Russian explorers detected peculiar gravity fluctuations emanating from beneath the ice. As a tribute to the Soviet geophysicist Grigory Gambertsev, the mountains were named in his honor. Despite a limited survey conducted in the 1970s, the true extent and shape of the Gambertsev mountain range have largely eluded understanding. Through a comprehensive study conducted from 2007 to 2009, scientists unveiled the astonishing age of the Gambertsev mountains tracing their formation back nearly a billion years. The Gambertsev Mountains continue to stand as one of Earth's least understood mountain ranges, captivating scientists with their enigmatic nature. Now, it's time for today's subscriber pick. Take a look at this image. It shows a human and alien-like figure lying on a bed, possibly in a lab. The figure resembles a well-preserved mummy. What do you think it could be? Do you think this is a mystery that could be related to any of our findings here today? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Number 5. The 57,000-Year-Old Wolf Pup 
During the summer of 2016, a gold miner in Canada's Yukon Territory made a remarkable discovery while excavating for precious metals. Using a water cannon to clear away frozen mud, he unintentionally uncovered a treasure that excited paleontologists, a nearly pristine 57,000-year-old female gray wolf pup. This mummified wolf pup was named Zur by the local Traandek Wechin community since it was found on their ancestral land. Zur, meaning wolf in their language, represents the most complete wolf mummy ever discovered, with her body preserved in permafrost for thousands of years. Only her eyes are missing from her otherwise intact form. The exceptional preservation of Jour's body, protected from air and moisture within the icy ground, provided scientists with a unique window into her life. X-ray analysis indicated that she was approximately six or seven weeks old when she passed away. Furthermore, geochemical analysis of her teeth revealed a diet primarily consisting of fish and aquatic creatures, rather than larger mammals like caribou or bison. Jour was found to be in good health, suggesting that she did not suffer from starvation or predator attacks. Instead, it is believed that she met her fate when her den collapsed, entombing her in sandy earth. Despite her untimely demise, Jour has provided valuable insights into the lives of wolves from thousands of years ago in the present-day Yukon Territory. Number 4. Sparta the Lion Cub This cave lion cub looks like it's just taking a nap, but actually died 28,000 years ago. The little cub, nicknamed Sparta, is quite the sight to behold. Despite its golden fur being matted with mud, its overall condition remains remarkably preserved. The teeth, skin, soft tissues, and organs are fully intact. Even her whiskers have been immaculately preserved. Sparta is one of two baby cave lions that were unearthed in 2017 and 2018. Mammoth tusk hunters stumbled upon them on the banks of the Semuelyak River in Russia's Far East. At the time of her demise, Sparta was less than two months old. Though the exact cause of her death remains uncertain, scientists have ruled out predation. However, scans have revealed skull damage, rib dislocation, and other skeletal distortions. Given the exceptional preservation, it is believed that she must have been rapidly buried. The possibilities include scenarios like a mudslide or falling into a crack in the permafrost. Cave lions like Sparta were once widespread across Europe and even to Alaska but are now extinct. They are closely related to modern lions. These magnificent creatures likely hunted large herbivorous animals of their time, including horses, deer, reindeer, bison, and even vulnerable young or aged mammoths. The reasons for their extinction remain unknown, but one theory suggests that the abundance of cave bears may have played a role in their decline. Number 3. The Three Incan Children In 1999, archaeologists made a disturbing find on Mount Lulayaco, which sits on the border between Argentina and Chile. Inside an icy tomb at the summit, they uncovered not just one but three children. They had been placed in a small chamber where they tragically froze to death, unintentionally becoming the best-preserved ice mummies ever found. The victims were believed to have been sacrificed by the Inca civilization around 500 years ago. Among them were a boy and a girl, both around six years old when they met their fate. The third was a teenage girl known as La Doncella, or the Maiden. Studies revealed that the children had been given a special diet leading up to their sacrifice, including coca leaves and a corn beer called chicha. In the weeks before their deaths, their consumption of these substances increased, suggesting they may have been kept in an altered state. This discovery offers a sobering glimpse into a dark chapter of human history. The remarkably preserved remains of these sacrificial victims serve as a reminder of the extremes to which people have gone in the name of religion and appeasing deities. Number 2. Ancient Viruses You know how viruses are the tiniest creatures that can wreak havoc on our health, causing all sorts of diseases? Well, it turns out we might have a new challenge on our hands. In 2015, a team of scientists from Ohio State University embarked on an expedition to the frozen expanse of the Tibetan Plateau, seeking ancient ice samples. Armed with a new method to study the ice while ensuring minimal contamination, they were eager to uncover valuable insights about the environment from thousands of years ago. Scaling the heights of the Gulia ice cap, 
situated 22,000 feet above sea level, the researchers retrieved a core that reached a staggering depth of over 1,000 feet. To their astonishment, within the ice lay a multitude of viruses, preserved for 15,000 years. Within this single ice core, the scientists discovered genetic material belonging to 33 different types of viruses, with 28 of them being completely unknown to science. While the Ohio team believes that none of these microbes pose a threat to human health, the same cannot be said for the countless other viruses that remain frozen in ice. As climate change melts glaciers at an alarming rate, there is a concerning possibility that ancient pathogens, once harmless in their icy slumber, could emerge into the modern world as potential dangers. Number 1. Amphipods You won't believe what researchers stumbled upon in Antarctica in 2022. While studying a river hundreds of kilometers from the edge of the Ross Ice Shelf, a team of New Zealand scientists made an unexpected discovery. Swarms of crab-like creatures lurking 1,600 feet beneath the icy surface. It all began with the scientists drilling through the ice to reach the river. Following this, they lowered their camera into the river and were taken aback when it was instantly surrounded by tiny amphipods. These little critters, resembling crabs, mites, and lobsters, measured about 5 millimeters in size. At first, they thought there was a problem with the camera, but as the focus improved, they realized they had stumbled upon a hidden world teeming with life. You see, scientists have long known about the existence of freshwater lakes and rivers beneath the Antarctic ice, but this was the first time they had a direct glimpse into one of these hidden waterways and the diverse wildlife within it. This incredible discovery not only highlights the resilience of life in extreme environments, but also underscores the importance of further exploration and study in these remote corners of our planet. Who knows what other surprises await us beneath the ice? We hope you enjoyed this video. We'll see you in the next one.